Keyvokers. What up, guys? This is Keyvokers. Back here again with another achievement guide. Today, we're going to be focusing on how to play B Simulator. This video is going to be more for people that don't have the game, that kind of just want to see what the game's about. I'm going to run you guys through the tutorial. So I'm going to go ahead and name my B Chivo. Now there are going to be three achievements or trophies related to the tutorial. I'll dive into those in just a sec. Great! Well, first things first. Let's teach you to fly like a bee. So the beginning of the tutorial is pretty simple. It's just teaching you how to fly around and the movement mechanics. In terms of the achievements, we're going to get three achievements during the tutorial. We're going to get an achievement for using our Beatro, which is pretty much like our Turbo. And then we're also going to be getting an achievement for using our B vision. You can use your B vision by clicking in the right thumbstick. The game is going to go over both of these features in the tutorial. And then finally, we are going to get an achievement for completing the tutorial. That was something. Now get to the construction room. Look for the golden markers. They always show the way. So real quick, I want to touch on how to get the completion in this game. First and foremost, you're going to have to beat the story mode. That's how I recommend starting this off. The story mode is going to take about three to four hours. We have a special place where you can learn how to be a bee. Just fly through this crack. After you complete the story mode, you want to work on all the miscellaneous achievements, like finding the lawyer note, finding the ring, taking the password on that ring and typing it in on the laptop. Also finding the Easter egg. Going to have video guides on all of these miscellaneous achievements. And then finally, we need to complete all of the challenges in the game. All of the challenges are represented by the glowing areas. Typically, the white glowing areas have achievements or trophies associated with them. The other challenges are going to have achievements for completing all of them. For instance, completing all of the dance challenges or completing all of the chase challenges. Also, you're going to want to keep an eye out for two missable achievements during the story mode. Both of the missable achievements are going to be awarded in the first hive, so you have to make sure that you get those before you move on to the second hive in the story mode. Again, I have videos that cover both of those missable achievements. Other than that, guys, I'm just going to go ahead and let the rest of the footage roll in the tutorial. Hope you guys enjoy this video. If this video helped you out, please leave a comment and don't forget to like and subscribe. The world is filled with different flowers, which our vision sees in different colors. little sister and now you're full of bistro
was fast. Okay, one last thing. A proper bee knows how to deposit her collected pollen. Now, follow the tunnel to return to the hive. I know all the basics. I'm ready to start on my new tasks. First, I should visit Mom. I mean, the Queen. Well, you must be very eager to get to work. I... There are many different jobs in the Hive. Scouts, guards, nannies. But most of us are honeybees, like me. Wow, I get to choose my job? Oh, no, silly. The queen decides. You must go see her. Hey, keeping busy? Hold it! Don't move! Why do you approach our queen? Hush, my guards. Let my newest child approach me. Well, little one, you are a honeybee now. Fly forth into the world, collect pollen for the hive. <laughs> 